All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. Today's video is going to be adding mixed numbers. We're paying attention, adding mixed numbers. Now, what is a mixed number, Kane? Alize? A, it has a whole number and a fraction. Okay, these are mixed numbers. We're adding these together. They have a whole number and a fraction. A whole number and a fraction. Now, first of all, we're going to start real simple, just adding the whole numbers together. So, Kane, what is 8 plus 7? Fifteen. So that's my whole number. Cain, what do I do next? We have three fourths plus three tenths. We have to get to the same denominator. So I take my denominators, four and ten, and I'm going to list out the multiples until I get the same multiple in both rows. Kane, you tell me when you see it. You see it? What is it? 20. 20 is the least common denominator. So I'm going to change both of these fractions so that they have a denominator of 20. So that they have a denominator of 20. Kane, 4 times what equals 20? 5. So I multiply this by 5 fifths. What's my numerator then, Kane? 15. So I have 15 twentieths. 3 times what equals 20, Kane? 2. And so what's my numerator? 6. So Kane, now I add, because it's an addition problem, 15 twentieths plus 6 twentieths is? Twenty-one twentieths. Awesome. Twenty-one twentieths. Now, Kane, what do you notice about that fraction? It is improper. So this says twenty-one divided by twenty. We're going to divide twenty-one by twenty. Kane, how many is tw how many times does twenty go into twenty-one? One time. Subtract. I get one remainder one, which equals one and one. 20th. Am I done? No. Because I have to add this over here to this. So if I add 1 and 1 20th, I'm going to get 16 and 1 20th. Okay, lots of steps, but it's not difficult. That paper you got has lots of steps, but they're not difficult steps. Let's do morning. Do you have Riley? No, she's over with Miss King. Miss King? Yes. Ariana? Yes, she's right here. Could I see her real quick? Is that okay? Yeah, she's right there. See her. <laughs> oh. I'll just borrow her real quick. I'll have her right Okay. Here. Thank you, sir. No problem. Three and one half plus one and one fourth. Three and one half plus one and one fourth. Kinley, what do I do first? Okay, so what is my least common thingy, as you say? Four. So I'm going to change both of these so they're over four. Kinley, is he the one already over four? Yeah. Okay, which one? The bottom one. Good. So one-fourth is over four. What do I multiply the top one by, Kinley? By two. So what's my numerator? Two. What do I do next, Kinley? What's two-fourths plus one-fourth, Kinley? Three-fourths. 
Is that a proper fraction? Can it be simplified? No. And then 1 plus 3 is what, Kinley? 4. So this thingy, the bigger thingy, is the whole number. This thingy on top is the numerator. And the thingy on the bottom is a denominator. So, now you do. <laughs> Boom, shaka, like a peace out. God bless, love you. Do something kind today. <laughs>